They look like chicken legs, but what are they really? This chicken is so delicious that I cook it every day. I will start adding in a pot 8 chicken legs, previously washed. Then I'm going to add 2 garlic cloves cut in half. A small onion cut into large pieces. A little carrot cut in half. 2 bay leaves to give it a rich flavor. And I'm going to spice up with a teaspoon of salt. Now I will add enough water to cover the chicken. I will cover and let cook for 15 minutes or until the legs are well cooked. After the time and the legs are cooked, I will turn off the stove and drain the water to let them cool. In another pot I will add 500 grams of potatoes cut into pieces. And I'm going to spice it up by adding a teaspoon of salt. I'm also going to add two bay leaves. And enough water to cover the potatoes. I will cover and let cook for 10 minutes or until soft. After the time, I will check if they are ready. For this I will push it with a fork, and if they do not stay stuck to the fork they are ready. Next, I will add the hot potatoes to a bowl, and with a potato masher, I will crush them until I follow a puree. Guys this recipe with chicken legs is very easy to make and is incredible and delicious, I'm sure everyone will like the result. Once I have turned a puree, I will season it by adding a teaspoon of salt. A teaspoon of garlic powder. A teaspoon of paprika. A pinch of black pepper. 80 grams of grated mozzarella cheese. And I will mix very well to incorporate these ingredients into the potatoes. At this moment I would like to know, from which country or city you look at us, to send you a special greeting in the next recipe. The greeting in today's recipe is for Lynette from New Jersey, also for Hannah Hafez from Egypt, and Christine Javier from Philippines. Thank you for always seeing and enjoying our recipes. And so we should be the mixture. In another bowl I have cooked chicken legs, which with my hands I will crumble, as follows. Don't vote the bone, as we'll use it later for this recipe. I will continue to crumble the chicken with my hands. And whether we should stay. I will add all the shredded chicken in the potato mixture. I will also add a tablespoon of dehydrated parsley. And I will mix well to incorporate it. If you have come this far seeing today's recipe, that means that you are liking this recipe. So leave us here below the following message, I love chicken legs, to send you a very special greeting. Now I'm going to take some of the mixture and make a ball out of it. Then I will crush it and place the chicken leg bone in the center and close it again, shaping it into a chicken leg. And so in this way we should stay. Next, let's bread it our chicken legs with potatoes, first I'm going to pass them through wheat flour. Then I will pass it through the mixture of two beaten eggs. And finally, I'm going to pass it for breadcrumbs. And so well breaded we should stay. In a pan I have enough oil, I will wait for it to heat up and then fry our chicken legs. Remember friends that the oil must be very hot because if you add it with cold oil, they will break it down. Already golden on one side, I'm going to turn it over so that the other side can be browned. And already our chicken legs with potatoes are ready, look how incredible they have been, a unique and different recipe, but I would like you to rate this recipe, from 0 to 10, to know if you liked the result. Thank you for watching this recipe until the end, I hope you liked the result. Tell me if it's the first time you see one of my recipes. And if so, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube as Recipes Oni and activate the bell so you can always receive our recipes. A hug and see you in the next recipe.